Ooh, this one's cute. This looks like a Gucci. Welcome back. Bienvenidos to day 19 already. Only a few more days before Santa arrives and the gift ideas um, continue because this weekend was very, very busy. My cousin arrived um, yesterday actually for Sunday. Um, had issues with the plane flying in from Ohio and so she arrived late last night um, after like 10 o'clock. And so we had to pick her up at the airport. I had her stay here with me. And so then today she left on the bus to go um, to Mexico, uh, border town, uh, across the border from Texas. It's really, really late. So I'm just gonna do the advent calendar for today so we can reveal what is in box 19. And this way I can go ahead and get actually some rest and we'll start fresh tomorrow. So I hope y'all had a really wonderful weekend and you are enjoying your holiday season. Maybe hopefully some of y'all are already off and enjoying the holidays. So if that's the case, please enjoy this holiday season. So let's get into a uh, box number 19, amigos. And by the way, my little, my cousin, she has her daughter who's eight years old and she absolutely was in love with the little Chanel tree and she was just wanting to take pictures with it. So it was so much fun having her here. And just FYI, those perfumes that I ordered, Amigas, the ones from La Tafa that I shared with you, if you haven't seen that video already, be sure to check it out on those fragrances because I had several, one of them was a Rouge Baccarat um, 540, um, best dupe ever. I actually sprayed it on earlier today and to me it still is on my skin it still has the stain powder as the original $300 bottle whereas this bottle runs you $17 so if you haven't checked out that video please be sure you go back and watch it I will link it down below but if you want a really great dupe an affordable dupe smells the same to me in my opinion that's a winner what I wanted to say was the other two fragrances in that beautiful pink and white bottle my cousin smelled them and she absolutely, absolutely fell in love with them. I like the pink one better. I like the white one, but the pink one, I just liked it better. But she loved the white one more. She was like, I please, por favor, vend them a She wanted me to sell them to her. And she wanted to buy the white one off of me. So I said, okay, go ahead and take it since she preferred that one the most. But then she said, can I buy the other one off of you? She says, because this way, at least I have one to go ahead and gift my mom. So she texted me a little while ago and she said that my um, 
my aunt, her mom absolutely loved the white one. So now my aunt is getting the white one and she's keeping the pink one. But they actually were legitimately beautiful, beautiful fragrances. And for the price at what Joma Shop was selling them for, they are really good um, perfume. So definitely check it out because they are absolutely wonderful at such an affordable price. All right, day 19, the S9 comes in again, another little really really cute box with these little prezzies here and ooh, this one is called devotion and this is an eau de parfum fragrance and really pretty lilac -y little bottle que dice este vamos a ver amigas this is a gourmand floral fragrance delectable and captivating mm, i like that and this is sea salt, jasmine, sambac, caramel, butterscotch, and cedarwood. I'm intrigued because I want to be captivated and delectable. All right. My husband's going to, my husband's going to say, you have one fragrance on one wrist and then you have this other one on the other one, but that's fine. So let's see. At first note, I'm getting the caramel. That sweetness really comes off initially. Once it starts to warm up, you get that sea salt. It's the butterscotch. It's the butterscotch and that caramel that's really coming forward initially. If you like sweet fragrances, for me, this one has more of the sweetness. That cedar wood warms it it warms up the sweetness the jasmine the jasmine there but it's not powerful unless in the dry down you probably smell it more but initially i'm not getting a jasmine floral i'm getting the delectable sweetness so the word delectable is key because of the caramel and the butterscotch so i mean it's nice you know, and a lot of men love sweet fragrances. This would be um, one that you could definitely um, consider using. Because of the butterscotch and the caramel notes, that comes forward more than a jasmine floral. So who knows, maybe in the dry down, it might smell really, really good, but I will definitely keep you posted. But it's a nice, a very nice, um, it's a sweeter. Out of all of the fragrances that have been in this advent calendar, this is by far the sweetest in me. For me, in my opinion, this one is the sweetest. Where if you want more of that delectable, um, sweet type of note in your fragrance, if you like that, this one is it. Devotion, Devotion, amigas, Devotion for day 19 in today's calendar. The delectable and this fragrance is the sea salt, the butterscotch, and the caramel for sure. So if you like sweet, if the person you're with loves sweet fragrances, this is it. Devotion, glass house fragrances. I hope y'all have had a wonderful weekend. Um, I'm still catching up on videos. It's just been really, really busy. And so then today when I got home, I was like, okay, why is it that there's always certain people that you end up forgetting like certain gifts? And for me, it's always the guys. There's always certain gentlemen, men in the family, the young ones that I forget. So here we were like, okay, let's go on base. So we went to base. So you saw a little bit of the footage there when I'm going into one of the Air Force bases and seeing all the planes and stuff. And so we actually went and actually knocked everybody out because they had every, a lot of things on clearance. So knock stuff out. And so we were able to get those presents out of the way. Now we got a wrap. Um, and so we went to the commissary so we can get some stuff because apparently I have award-winning cookies. I have a really, really good cookie recipe that I've doctored up from what I saw on the Food Network like over 10 years ago. And my husband won the best cookie award when I made them for him when we were dating. So, and it's now expected that I make that cookie for him um, every year. Plus I make another fun holiday treat. I call it the Christmas crack. It's been nicknamed that. 
So yeah, we're gonna be busy again these next few nights to kind of make some of that stuff ready for this weekend and to take a few to work. All right, amigos, I'm going to uh, hit the hay. I just uploaded a video for a Military Monday, but I have great gift ideas in there. Be sure to check that one out. It's not just for um, military, it's for military and first responders that are eligible for those discounts for those two um, online retailers that I mentioned. One is Grunt Style, really, really cool, fun shirts, but be sure to check out the video because I do mention Garrett's Popcorn and that one that is an Oprah's favorite and it's regardless of whether you are eligible for the discount or not, it's an all around really, really great um, online uh, store for food, for popcorn. They are the best. Um, a lot of imitators, but to me, that is my all-time favorite that I gift that for all various types of occasions. So be sure to check that out because it's another really, really good, fun um, gift idea for the holidays. Somebody that has everything, you want something different, something fun that everybody will love and appreciate it, and they will be asking you for year after year after year is Garrett's. Check it out. Highly recommend it. All-time, all-time favorite. Again, Oprah's favorite thing can't steer you wrong. Uh, good night. I will see y'all mañana for day 20, amigos.